Hey, Coach Frank, today we're talking about another issue. We had another video uh, before about infield outfield thro throwing. So let's continue on that. Um, just giving you my quick thoughts. Of course, uh, if you're a coach or a parent, you, you know, you do what you got to do or what you think is correct. But what we're talking about today is uh, positioning. So while players are younger, I would recommend let them play any position. Don't think that your son just or daughter, just because they're tall, is locked in at uh, first base. Or if you got a child that's a really good athlete, has to go to shortstop, or they may have the strongest arm. Uh, as they get older, those traits you'll probably look for more. Uh, but when I would say, what I would say is definitely not t-ball and lower. But when you start getting to the coach pitch, um, up to probably the 13, 14 range uh, is where I would say you start uh, specializing. So in between, uh, lower, let's just say below the 13, 14 league, unless you have player enough players that can actually lock into specific positions, I would say play them everywhere. Play them as much as you can. You can never have too many pitchers. You can never have too many good catchers. Uh, when you get above that, then the specialization can start because the bodies of the young uh, players are now uh, getting them to where they're more specified. Or you may have so, a couple players that are just utility players, which is great, where they can kind of fill in anywhere or they can be pretty proficient at any position. So that's my thoughts on that. Play them all over the place. When they get older and you have enough people that can start specializing, then you can start doing that. But you're going to make a better ball player if they can play multiple positions and understand uh, those multiple positions. This is Coach Frank signing off. We'll talk to you soon. Thank you.